everyone welcome back to another video where today we are going to be doing a sunset on procreate which i literally got today as an easter gift so i got <laughs> anyway i went to spray painting then i went to a uh, fat nozzle <laughs> then i chose like quite like a bright not a bright vivid orange but also not a dark orange just kind of like in the middle uh more dark than light though uh, then I went for kind of like quite a light blue and I did almost half but not quite you can see it there then I went for a purple but I thought oh that isn't quite light enough uh, dark enough because you know the night sky is going down don't really think that needs much explanation so I just kind of went forward and back with the purples and I thought you know that's pretty good so then I went for a yellow and I was like, wait, that's green. <laughs> so I went up a little bit and I was like, yeah, yellow. So I went, put that a little bit across my screen. Then I clicked the little wand icon and I hit uh, Gaussian Blur, hit Layer. And then I swiped about like 50 something percent. Because 100% looks stupid, look. So I, I did like 50-ish percent. I tapped the screen and then I hit Apply. My throat is really hurting right now. It's dry. Um, anyway, I went to like quite a light blue. And then I went to um, elements. And then I went for clouds. And then I kind of did a cloud, but I thought that looked stupid because of how blue it is. So I, did for a, I went for a perfect white. And I went over that. <coughs> So I kind of just like was drawing clouds everywhere, and um, this, yeah, it like it's not gonna be there for much longer because <laughs> uh, I had to get rid of all of it. So yeah. Anyway, once it's all changed, future me, what does it look like? Hey, it looks pretty good. So now what I'm doing, I clicked the little wand icon, and then I scrolled. Um, I went to Gaussian Blur, then I scrolled like up, I think I did, I think about 13 or 50 something, I'm not, I did 13 for this one, like around 13%, or 13 precisely, uh, so then I hit apply, like I clicked and then I hit apply, uh, then I went down to luminance, just give me a second to find it, because I was really, you know, dumb. <laughs> Uh, so yeah, I clicked flare. I I clicked it again. Don't ask me why. Um, but yeah. <laughs> and then I went for a yellow, which actually doesn't end up looking very good. Ow! <laughs> Sorry about that. So yeah, it doesn't really look. Ugh, I don't know. I don't. I don't like that. Uh, yeah, and it really just does not look good there either. So. I decided that I was going to uh, do a different colour. I did a pure white. <laughs> I've had to re-record this voiceover about three or four times because I've had my um, mic hurts or sample rate at like too, mu too much hurts. Yeah, this is the colour of the sun. That's what the sun looks like from Earth when it's sundown. What? sunset just one sun looks good like i feel I, like i like that I, I don't like it when it like it was before like it, this looks better but yeah uh i hope you guys like this um oh wait no i forgot i forgot i need to do a yellow hue and i also need to do the bouquet lights so i accident i didn't click the bouquet lights and i accidentally did another flare so um, I used the bokeh lights and I was like, whoa, that is far too much. So I uh, turned the uh, opacity low. And I was like, ooh, that's a bit too much. I turned it even lower to the point where you can't really see it. And then I kind of went over it a little bit more so you could see them. So it kind of just looked like it was a picture being taken, uh, like with the like reflections on there because that's like the kind of vibe I wanted it to be that's why I did everything quite blurry <clears throat> right 